name is Pierre Ipsal, I'm EIT manager in Europe and I'll be presenting the EIT system. So EIT stands for Efficiency Improvement Tool. It's uh, the GIBO line monitoring and plant intelligence system that we developed since 1996. Our job starts with PLC logic uh, programming. We will be implementing our monitoring logic inside each of your uh, equipment all over the line from the depalletizer to the palletizer basically and we will make sure that all the data are aligned and precise to gather all in one central server. Once the data are in the server we will display and spread the information all over your factory thanks to a very user-friendly web uh, interface that is full responsive design. This means that the EIT can be displayed on any computer tablet, smartphone, or any browser that you have in your company with no limitation. So what I'll be uh, showing today is first the data that we collect. So for each equipment, we'll be detecting the very first root cause of the stoppages and the production losses, together with a performance indicators like the production, the, the speed, and efficiency, and so on. What you see just under here, this number, is a trademark from a uh, from Jibo Cermex called AQ Block that aims at giving the information of the available dynamic accumulation between each equipment and the key machine of the line, which is the critical machine. So by simply looking at this layout, you know at any moment what accumulation is available. So if I go and look at a dedicated screen, our AQ Block layout, you see that EIT is capable to calculate and precisely estimate how much uh, accumulation is available, how many bottles is between each machine, to be able to point out and to make uh, obvious what time the operator has available to intervene on the machine. For example, if the operator has to make a quick cleaning on the labor, he knows that he can do it within two minutes. If you open the door, clean the labeler, manage to close back and go back in production within two minutes, you will not be stopping the critical machine and thus not impact the global line efficiency. This is one of the key features uh, of the EIT, but of course the EIT includes also many other troubleshooting and analysis modules such as line audits with drill down capabilities and so on. We'll demonstrate this maybe in another video. Thank you.